taking them so long? Eunice, it's a kidney transplant. So we're going to miss the movie, is that it? <laughs> Eunice, they got to take a whole kidney out of the big guy and put it into Danny, and then they got to stitch them both up again, and that's going to take at least a half an hour. <laughs> Mom. Yes? Is something the matter? Yes, dear. That's why we're here in the hospital. <laughs> no, Ma, I mean, is something the matter between you and Aunt Mary? Aunt Mary? Why aren't you speaking? I thought I was. <laughs> no, Ma, I mean, why aren't you speaking to Aunt Mary? Oh, because, Billy, you asked me the question, and if I responded to Aunt Mary instead of you, uh, then you'd think I was crazy. <laughs> How can you some more coffee, Ma? Thanks. <laughs> Oh, Mrs. Tate, I feel so terrible. If Danny hadn't tried to save my life, then... Now, Gwen, you've just got to stop this. It's a very simple operation, but it's so risky. Gwen, there's always going to be risks. I remember when I was a girl, there was this lady, the crazy old lady we called her, but she hardly ever spoke to any of us, but when I walked by her house, she'd bang her cane on the window and say something like, Manya, 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 manya! <laughs> I was scared to death of her. <laughs> See, but one day my mother said, well, instead of being afraid and calling her a crazy old lady, why don't you go ring the bell, introduce yourself, and try to make her feel like she's not a crazy old lady. <laughs> so I did. Because I took a risk. <laughs> Do you understand? Thank you, Mrs. Tate. You're welcome, dear. Um, how did you react when you rang her bell? Oh, she said, Monia, 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 and hit me in the head with the cane. <laughs> going to be fine. Everything's going to be just as it was before. <laughs> well, almost. <laughs> Mrs. Campbell, are you all right? Oh, yes, fine, thanks. I just want you to know that it's, uh, it's okay what went down between you and Chester. <laughs> thanks. I mean, it happened before I was even born. I'll be brief. I've just spoken to the powers that be. And I think you all should know exactly what's going on. Oh, yes, Daddy, please. Tell us what you found out. Well, it's like this. You will all be boarding soon. <laughs> this is an important mission. Some of you won't be coming back, but we must go. For the sake of free people everywhere. I only wish to hell I could be going with you. Daddy. Daddy, we are not in an airport. We're in a hospital. What? Any damn fool can tell you you can't board a plane in a hospital. <laughs> Who's the idiot that planned this mission? Oh, bad news, General. This is not an airport. <laughs> Bert? What's happening? How's Danny? Is Jody, Jody okay? Sit down, Bert. Gee, I think I'll go for a little walk in the lair. The lair is great. Yeah. Air. 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 Uh, Dutch, the lair? Air, great. Where, where, where are we going? Where are we going? Are we going? <laughs> What's going on? Where's everybody going? Ah, uh, Man, please tell me now, is Danny okay? Is, where's Jody? Jody's in California. What do you do, mail the kidney? Uh, Jody isn't the donor, Bert. Chester is the donor. Chester? Tate? But this tall, you with Jess? I didn't think I'd ever have to tell you. Mary, come on, just tell me, please, tell me. Maybe I should have told you before. Maybe I should have told everybody, but I thought it would upset so many people, so I didn't. Maybe if I told at the time, maybe that was deceitful, and if I had told at the time, Jesse wouldn't be, and you won't be. But maybe you would be anyway if I told you when we met. Then you wouldn't have married me, and we wouldn't have had Scotty, you see. <laughs> Not exactly. Chester and I, 
a long time ago. Chester and I. <laughs> Chester is Danny's father. So Danny is getting a matching kidney, is that is this right? Yes. Oh, good man! Thank God! <laughs> Bert, you don't mind what I just told you? Mind? I don't know if I mind. All I care about is that this Danny's got a kidney! <laughs> Bert, it's so wonderful. It doesn't bother you, even a little? I don't know, man, I don't know. I guess it really doesn't matter. Danny's okay! Well. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Ma'am, there's just one little thing I don't understand. Chester. <laughs> that was incredible. You were incredible. I was incredible? You were incredible. Yeah. You were pretty incredible, too. Uh, was it more incredible than anyone else? Who else is here? No, 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 no. I mean, I mean. Was it better than... What? Guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Maggie, it was the best. It was absolutely the best. I feel terrific. My luck. I finally have a fantastic heterosexual experience, and I'm gonna die at sunrise. <laughs> Maggie, this may sound a little strange, but I'm really glad you're here. It does sound strange. I'm glad I'm here, too. So, since there uh, doesn't seem to be anything to lose, why don't we... Um... Why don't we? I love you. Oh, I know. Maggie, I was just thinking about asking you to marry me. Oh, Jody. <laughs> what is that? It's rats! <laughs> what are you eaten by rats? No, 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 no! Maybe we're going to be rescued. You're right. Hey, in here. Shh, shh. In here. Quiet. We're getting out. I can't believe it. In here. Still want to marry me? We'll talk. In here. <laughs> free. I'm free at last. <laughs> 25 years I've been digging out of here. Excuse me, sir, but this is the next cell. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> of course I'll marry you. 